Hello, Scorpios. This is your reading for the 21st to the 22nd. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. I'm going to pull some energy for you guys today. And then from the Vice Versa Tarot here, I'm going to go ahead and pull some energy for the person that is lurking around you energetically and um, see what they want with you guys, okay? So let's see what's going on with Scorpio. What's going on with Scorpio today? Ooh, death. That's your card. Um, one to transform some energy, I feel, definitely within yourself, maybe even in a situation. Some of you are wanting to end your relationship or your job even um, because you feel like it's time for a change is what I'm getting from you guys, okay? Let's see what else we got. Two of Cups. I feel you definitely want to see some change in a relationship here um, for sure. Hmm. Five of Cups, yeah. I'm getting that once. You guys have felt very confused and conflicted around a love situation with someone. Um, felt like you, you feel like you, you can't get this love back. There is no love like this. This ended. The situation ended with you and someone else here, okay? But there is still very much a connection here with you and this person. Could be a Cancer, could be another Scorpio like yourself even. But um, I'm thinking that you guys feel like there's nothing that you can do in this situation, but uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what's going on here, okay? Let's see what else we've got. I'm going to put another card on the side of the Five of Cups here nine of swords yeah a lot of you guys are just concerned and worried about um this connection whether or not you know you can actually have this love this connection with this person again this relationship with this person and this is something that you guys probably think about you know day and night or either this is someone else thinking this about you guys here um gemini energies here as well but somebody has their back turned to you currently and i'm feeling like both of you guys are probably feeling the same way but um the other person is more of one of you not necessarily the other person because the energy can go vice versa but one of you is definitely more in your head thinking about um with an overactive imagination worrying yourself into a tizzy um what could never happen was not going to happen um what did happen just anything that you could possibly think of in a negative aspect that's what this person is doing here okay um basically five of cups is feeling very emotional um because this person is probably feeling this connection so heavily or has felt this connection so heavily, whether it's you or the other person, that it's like um, thinking about not reuniting or not coming together. It's like, like a stab in the heart almost for this individual, okay? So both of you are in this mode where you're kind of down about this connection and not being together, the fact that it ended, okay? But there's definitely an interest, I feel, to bring this back to life to put some more action and energy into this somebody's definitely interested in revisiting this situation is what i'm getting here okay see what i'm talking about bringing it back to life somebody is currently making a decision i feel on this relationship and whether or not to try again okay i feel like this is you scorpio okay I think um, maybe you guys have maybe a Gemini, Aries individual that or Cancer that you are um, that is significant to you guys here. Yeah, strong Aries. I feel in your reading maybe Libra or Taurus individual as well that you guys want to start over with. You see growth with this person. You see maturity with this person, um, a very supportive energy, somebody that can stand on their own two feet without anybody else's input, okay? But you want to grow with this individual. You see them as, you know, your person right now. And as I say that, the Four of Wands flips out here. Um, strong Aries individual in, in your reading, okay? You guys once had this very strong connection here. 
And I feel like, you know, both of you are feeling the, um, the loss, honestly. One of you is feeling it more, you know, on a, on a more emotional level. The other person is thinking about all the horrible things, but they're adding, you know, m more fuel to the fire like you know just blowing things out of proportion that are not really there just worrying um you know just worrying day and night day and night possibly um they're not really sleeping that well daydreaming even you guys may even be dreaming about each other you know that sort of thing but um there's a very strong connection here and I feel like you guys are wanting to revisit this. I think the other person probably, they think about it, but I think they have, somebody's not really facing themselves, I feel. Because judgment is also taking a look in the mirror, you know, um, taking a look, look at your own actions to see you know where you possibly could do better you know what you possibly can change what can you do to raise your vibration and I'm getting that um, somebody here is just really not wanting to do that you know or they have a hard time doing that not that they don't want to but I think they have a hard time doing that okay I don't feel like this is a bad person but I definitely feel like there's somebody here that's not really um, being truthful to themselves okay i'll put it that way i don't know why i'm shuffling here so let's go ahead and see who's coming towards scorpio who's coming towards scorpio who's coming towards scorpio hmm the star your destiny somebody that is healing mm -hmm. your path and the Queen of Wands. Hmm. This person, I feel, is definitely um, was meant to cross paths with you. Okay. This person is possibly also meant to be your life partner, your husband, your wife, you know, your mate for life. But we have free will. Okay. So that's that. This person currently has their back turned away from this connection. They know exactly who you guys are, though. Just like I feel you know who they are. But for some reason, um, you know, they have their back turned currently. I feel like they're healing. They're following their path. Okay. And their path is leading them away from this connection. Um, and I'm assuming, you know, when you guys broke up, that is probably what put them on their path to healing now whether you guys come back together or not again free will is at play there is a decision to be made here though okay about this love connection so you guys know who needs to do what all right so let's see what they want from you guys what does this person want from scorpio what does this person want from scorpio the Six of Wands. Hmm. They want to stop fighting, I feel. And they want to go forward successfully. Healing. Healing. We have the Six of Wands and the Ace of Cups, all right? So this person is wanting to move forward successfully, to be victorious in this situation. But they, they feel like being victorious... The only way they can be victorious is to move away and find new things, go a new path, a new direction that's going to make them happy. Okay? It's what I'm getting here. They're going towards their own happiness. And I feel like this person spreads love to other people. They are noticed by other people here. And I'm feeling like they spread the love all the way around. Um, this person may be a healer with the star being there as well. Okay. Now, and I will say this. I don't feel like this person does not want to be with you. That's not the feeling that I get here. 
because I'm getting that this person knows exactly who you guys are and they probably have for a while okay but what I'm getting is that there are lots of fights and arguments and that this person feels like they held all the burden on their shoulders and for them to have their stability here they need to move away successfully they need to go forward successfully on their own towards the ace of cups loving themselves first and foremost and doing new things helping other people so i do get that they love you i get that but i'm thinking that they want to move forward and they want to feel the same um what is it they want to feel unconditional love from you guys okay because this person is doing everything but addressing this situation acknowledging it right here but not addressing it like with you they know exactly who you are okay they're thinking a lot about certain things that happen between the two of you finding their own stability thinking about also that you guys were very stable once upon a time here but yet still with the four of wands and the six of wands there was a lot that was bogging you guys down this person feeling like they've been bogged down feeling like they've been beat down and they're just wanting to leave that behind and move forward okay and I'm thinking that they want you guys to move forward with them but I'm thinking there's a lot that needs to change in this situation a lot that needs to be addressed here is what I'm getting from this okay so we have Leo Aquarius Aries um, Gemini, Cancer, Libra, Taurus, energy here. Okay? So that's what I have for you. And I will be speaking with you guys soon.